Hey, T T Squad. What's good? What's good, T? What's going on? Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Oh my goodness. I can't remember the last time I sat down in front of the camera, filmed something. It has been way too long. But I am coming back. I'm going to be filming a lot more. But I need you guys to be a little, little more interactive. Let me know what you want to see because so much has changed, guys. I feel like I've said, said this a lot. Every time I, you know, take a little sabbatical and come back from you, on YouTube, I think I, I think I see a lot that things change. That's because, like, things are changing and, and they're changing for the better. But, you know, I need my channel to grow with me. Right, so I, I need you guys to like tell me what you want to see. Tell me what you want to see more of. I need you guys to also follow me on Instagram because I post a lot more there. I'm a lot more active there. So follow me on Instagram at Tammy Times with four Z's. So you guys can keep up to me day to day. I'm not going to be posting weekly video, videos anymore, you guys, because I'm, I'm really busy. My business is really growing and I cannot commit to weekly videos, but I'm definitely going to be still posting videos, period right and the more um interactive you guys are the better because then i would know what you guys want to see but i posted a poll on instagram and i asked um if you guys would love me to do a huge tech review well not a review because this is a lot of stuff but an unboxing video and a lot of people said yes i didn't know that you guys were so into tech like that's me i love technology like you know the design and all that stuff is good but i love 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 technology and i have been working on getting this stuff for a couple months now um i really wanted to have a nice uh office setup where i can do my work and, and trade and all that stuff and i actually had my uncle build me this desk it looks really nice i i wanted something that fit me and what i wanted personally and he made that vision come to life it's so nice nice and black and shiny i love it and I had my my wall, I had my wall painted in gray because the color scheme that I was going for with my computer setup was black and white. Uh, this computer chair here, this is Rico's computer chair. He's actually right over there uh, building my. So by the time this video is at, um, ended or at the end of the video, when I do a nice little montage of everything, when, it, when everything is finished set up, you guys will see my video. But he's building that right now. But this is his, just a plan black chair this is what he wanted but my chair is really cute i can't wait to, for you guys to see it but without further ado let's get into the video i'm gonna unbox these things i'm not gonna go too much into detail about everything because again this is a lot of stuff right so i just wanted to unbox it show you guys what i got show you guys my whole setup and yeah that's pretty much it if, if you guys do want me to go into detail about anything that you see me on box here just let me know below and i will make a separate video on that cool also okay. i'm gonna start with smaller items and then we're gonna get to this big boy right here right so i have my scissors to open these packages and we're gonna start with uh, this, this is the smaller item right here so this is the this is my webcam from logitech so guys uh, like I said, I'm really into technology and when I was doing my research on this stuff I t When I tell you I did my research, I did my research. I watched so many YouTube tutorials On uh, all of this stuff that I purchased just so that I can have like the best opinions And I, I didn't like to have like the best stuff that it felt. everything everything is relative when it comes to the best But I wanted to have what I would prefer to be the best stuff so this camera did a lot of reviews on it and it has a lot of good reviews. I don't remember how much it cost. I think it was like 80 US. But this web camera is really good. The IMAT has a, a webcam as well, but it isn't as good as it should be for the price that these damn computers cost. So I purchased a webcam uh, because I'm gonna be I have like conference calls, I have online meetings, I have team meetings and they're online, so I wanna have like good good visual. I won't want it to be like looking at pixels and all that stuff. It's just like good quality. So I purchased this camera uh, so that I can hook it up to my iMac and have better quality. So this is, like I said, a Logitech uh, C920 Pro HD webcam. All right? I think I'm going to have everything listed in my um, description of everything that I have here. All right? So that's the webcam. 
Uh, this is like a, a shutter part, so when I'm not using the webcam, I could actually close down the camera part. So I, I, that was an additional cost for this piece. So yeah, that has to come for sure. This, oh my goodness, this is the best mouse, and I and dare I say it, yes, the best mouse you guys would ever come across. This. This mouse is amazing. The reason why I purchased this mouse, and I know the iMac comes with the mouse, Tammy. Uh, I know. But that iMac mouse is so much crap. <laughs> From all the reviews that I did, that I watched, a lot of people complain about that iMac mouse. And the main thing that is that is very annoying about that mouse is that when it has a charge, the charger is at the bottom of the mouse. So if you have to charge it, you're gonna literally turn the mouse upside down to charge it. So that I cannot work with that. <laughs> but um, when I was reviewing this mouse, when I was searching for a mouse, a lot of persons were talking about this mouse specifically. Like I feel like 95% of the, the videos that I watched on YouTube, the persons were talking about this mouse. So this is the MX Master S2 Logitech mouse. Yeah, but a bunch of this stuff is Logitech actually. But this mouse, why I like about this mouse so much is that I'm gonna be using my iMac and I'm still gonna be using my MacBook laptop. So when I'm using my iMac and I want to go over onto my laptop screen, I don't have to use a separate mouse for that. This mouse can literally go from screen to screen but once I take the cursor into the corner it'll automatically go onto that next screen that feature alone they got my money from that <laughs> literally so this mouse is amazing and it is oh my goodness it is beautiful oh my god and I had to get it in white look at that whoa this mouse is amazing whoa 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 this is a lovely white mouse you guys and this actually this mouse comes in three colors. The other two colors were way cheaper. I think it was like 60 US or something, but because this white one, <laughs> this white one cost me 80, 86 US or something like that. I don't know why, because the color is white, I don't know, but I I, I literally had this mouse in my, with Amazon wish list for weeks. And, I, and at some point I was like taking it out, putting in a black one, I was like, I don't need a white mouse, I don't need a white mouse. Cause this extra cost, so I was like, no, I need to wait most of it back up, put it back in my car. But I decided I had to get it because my desk, my desk is black, and then my most part is like a charcoal kind of black. So I couldn't have a black mouse on that if it was going for the black and white color scheme. So I settled and I got the white mouse for the extra cost, whatever. And I have the USB of course for it to charge, and it is a wireless mouse, and I can charge it while I use it. Unlike the um. The iMac mouse. So this here, you guys, is just a headphone stand for my headphones. I purchased some headphones while I'm working. You know, this table is a, a two-sided table. So one side over here is for record. This side is for me. We have a separator in the middle. So he may not want to be listening to what I'm listening to all the time. So I got a, a pair of headphones. I'm gonna open that next because I'm super excited about those headphones. But this is the headphone stand. Nothing special about this. It is white. I think it is supposed to be. Oh. It is silver. So the silver headphone stand and my headphones. So this is a special. It's just headphone stand. This right here, you do this one first. This is just a. Uh, I don't remember what you call this, but uh, you know, uh, the devices only have so many USB ports that you can use at a time of night. I don't like having to unplug something to plug in something else to unplug. I don't like that. So this is just like a, an extender for USB port. So I just plug in, I plug in the one side into the, the, the computer and then I have, a, I have four extra ports for my USB. So that's just what this is. Um, like I said, I did a lot of reviews so I made sure that I got everything that I would need so I won't have to try to go, go back and order anything, anything like that. I am super, super excited to see these headphones and I, I wanted to film this video for you guys and I was like, today is Tuesday, I got home from overseas, Saturday, so I had these headphones since Saturday and I wanted to see them so much, but I promised that I will not open them so that I can give you guys my honest expression when I see these. So these are the Bose Quiet Comfort 35. 
uh, two headphones. So I, a lot of good reviews on there. There are a lot of good reviews on headphones, but I was able to, to test these out. Uh, shout out to Juju, Juju Wanderer. Uh, he has a pair of these, and one day he let me listen to them, and I literally, and I'm not exaggerating you guys, I literally could not hear anything else. Like these are literally the best, well, the best that I've listened to some cancellation headphones. And he, I was sold at that point. So when I went straight to Amazon and I saw then there, I was gonna get the silver pair because it only came in silver, black, and like a rose gold. But I didn't want a rose gold, but I'm gonna go back to my color scheme. The black, that was a little too basic for me. The silver I would have settled for, but then I ended up going on both websites and I saw that you could customize, yes. You could customize these headphones. So when I saw that, it cost me a little more. If you got these headphones on Amazon, there are about, I think, 300 or 300 US, yeah. But because I wanted them customized to what I wanted, I had to pay a little more. It cost me 350 to get them customized, and then with tax, brought it to about 380 US dollars to have these headphones customized. But I do not regret it at all. So I wanted to give you guys my honest honest opinion on these headphones so i refuse to open them uh before i film this video so here is the box i have to download the app like my ua already have the app downloaded of course. <laughs> moment of truth I imagine I literally custom made these you guys every the color this little yellow in here I literally did everything oh my god these headphones are beautiful oh my goodness and when you guys see my computer chair you're gonna understand why I did my headphones this color oh my goodness these are perfect God, you guys get look at this. These are perfect. Ah, yes, I am happy. I am super, super, super stuck. Listen, I, I could finish this video right here. <laughs> oh my goodness, I am so happy about these headphones. I can just build about these a little more when I finish this video, but oh my god. I am happy and it comes with a lovely case that I can travel with. Um, but these are going to be on my headphone stand. I can show you guys, but I am happy. I am very happy. I am very happy with this. <laughs> Let's keep moving on. Let's keep moving on. Alright, so I don't have to unbox this. These are some lights that I'm going to run at the back of my desk because my keyboard lights up in multiple colors. So these lights are gonna match my keyboard. I'm gonna have my uncle come and set this up for me and run it at the back of my computer desk so the lights reflect off of the wall. It's gonna be a vibe. It's gonna be a vibe. So I'm not gonna undo this. I'm just gonna help, let you guys see how it looks when it's done. All right, uh, next, I don't need to undo this. This is just a, a hard drive because filming these videos, it takes up a lot of memory, you guys. So I need external hard drive. This is a terabyte uh, rugged mini. So Juju, shout out to Juju again. He actually recommended me to get this one because I had another hard drive and it dropped. And when hard drive dropped, they mash up. <laughs> so this one, this, this actually has like a rubber uh, surrounding it. So when it drops, it doesn't mash up. So I, this costs like 60 US or 65 US or something. I actually got it. It was actually 80 US. And by the time I was ready to purchase it, it went down to like 60 US. I think it's 60 US I got it for. So I got it on a good deal because apparently this is really expensive, especially in Barbados. But I purchased all this stuff from Amazon, you guys. Um, this, this is just a case that I got for my mouse. So when I'm traveling, I want to keep this, I want to keep that mouse safe because it was expensive. 
because I'm not supposed to have that just in my bag. <laughs> um, okay, this is just my most pad. It's a long most pad. Um, let's show you guys. So this is really long. Like I told you, it's like a charcoal black. Right? So this is going to go right there. Right? So just a plain most pad. A nice support at the back. Feels really good. Yeah. Next up, we have this. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm not gonna answer this right now, but when the video at the end of the video, when I do a nice little montage, you're gonna see. But this is my rug, you guys. And it's. I'm not gonna say. It. I'm gonna let you get to the end. You have to see it all the way to the end to see what this is. So this is a dragon pad. So I. What I'm gonna. This is a. Um, like a. What is this? A microphone stand. <laughs> this is what that is. So these are for this. This right here, you guys. This is the ultimate mic. I did so much reviews on this because it was not cheap as well. This bad boy cost me, I think it was a hundred and, I don't remember, a hundred and something US. I think it was, yeah, 120 or between, between 120 and 160 US. But I did a lot of uh, uh, reviews on this, you guys, and this mic is really, really good. So, uh, again, I love good quality, good quality videos, good quality audio. So, I make sure to get this because I want when I'm doing my um, online calls, presentations, all that stuff, that I have good audio. So, bought this mic, and a lot of, a lot of people on YouTube use this mic. A lot of people in recording studios use this mic. So this got some good reviews. So I definitely am very happy with this purchase. Very, very happy with this purchase. And I just got that other stuff that like I showed you guys to um, to set it up good. Right? Oh. Yeah. Woo! Woo this mic is heavy too. This is the Blue Yeti mic. This is gonna be, this could either be sat on my, my table. This looks so nice on here, you guys, look at that. Look at how that white and black is looking, oh my God. And this could sit on the table, but why I got this stand is to have it hung above me. You're gonna see at the end. I'm gonna have a montage at the end when everything is fully set up. But this mic is, is supposed to making a mess of this. <laughs> this stand, is gonna get mounted on my computer table and the mic is gonna get attached to it and it's gonna be like hung over me like that like a legit studio mic so it wouldn't be on my table because I don't want the table too cluttered and all that stuff next up is my keyboard so this keyboard again I did a whole bunch of research on it and I got a lot of nice reviews. I mean, everybody is entitled to their own opinion when it comes to technology. Um, but I like this keyboard a lot because because I'm so used to Mac to Apple products and how slim their keys are on the on the laptop. I wanted a keyboard that was very similar to that, and this Mac, this this keyboard reflected that. And because why I chose it is because of course it's white. It, it, the the colors that I took in the keyboard and because it's longer so I have like, the option of having my numbers at the side so that I can type those instead of having it at the top like a MacBook has and this is a wireless keyboard this cost me I think this is like like 60 between 60 and 80 US uh, but this keyboard is really nice really good weight very like nice lily white keyboard and it is very beautiful when it is even it is set up when I, I'm going to show you guys, of course, but it lights up really, really nice. I'm going to have all of that set up for you guys at the end of the video, so you have to keep watching. Like I told you guys, I'm going to be using my iMac along with my MacBook right next to it. So all this is, is a stand so that I can have my, keep my laptop like elevated a little bit right next to my uh, MacBook. So that's just a stand that I'm going to have my laptop on top of. This, oh, I forgot to show you guys this. This is the, let me show you how, how legit this is gonna be like a studio setup. So this is the 
the dragon pad that is gonna go in front of my my so this is like an amplifier you grow extra you know and it's pink and white matches my headphones right so we're excited about that as well i can't wait till you guys see how the end product looks you gotta stay tuned you gotta keep watching all the way to the end next up oh, is this now of course i'm not about to leave this gray wall just as the gray wall your girl must have some art set up here make the wall up presentable when i'm filming i got low you know what i mean so this right here is my first ever art piece that i purchased that's gonna go in the center of my wall right above my iMac and you guys know if you don't know your girl i trade for an exchange currencies like that is my profession i've been learning for a year and six months almost seven months now so i'm really 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 big on this and this art piece simply just reminds me of everything that i'm doing when it comes to trading and you know being that being that trading is like virtual money because you're trading is correct the short for foreign exchange so all it i don't i don't see cash <laughs> i don't have cash in my hand all of my money is virtual right everything is done virtually the money is sent back to the bank virtually I don't have cash so this is a reminder of some cash and correct <laughs> This is beautiful. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. So this right here represents Forex. So Forex is currency. So we got a bunch of currencies behind here in pretty color. This this is gonna be perfect. And ironically, when I had decided to paint this wall gray, it was long before I knew I was gonna buy this. When I saw this on uh, Amazon, I was like, this is perfect. And the picture that they had uh, displayed it. It was on a grill wall and I was like, look at alignment. <laughs> Perfect match. So this is going to go right on my wall, right above there. Uh, so like I was saying, we got currencies behind here, currencies all behind here. And this is a bow. So in Forex, we, um, Forex represents, are represented by bulls and bears. So the bow means that when the when price is going up, when you're buying the currency, that's the bow. And beers mean when you are selling the currency. So this one I got the bow because it looks really, really, really dope. Along with the currencies behind there, this is just sick. This is sick, sick, sick. So I, I, I'm really happy with this art piece. I don't know who painted it, and it cost me. It cost me seven to you guys. Good purchase. <laughs> all right. So we are finally to what you've all been waiting for. Apart from the end of this video, when you get to see the finished product. My iMac. So this is a big one. This is the 27 inch 2019 iMac desktop. And I've been wanting one of these for a long, long time. This is not cheap. <laughs> this computer cost me about $4,600. <laughs> but I'm super, super happy about this purchase. It's something I wanted for a really long time. I literally manifested it. And with, of course, hard work. Our work pays off and for all of my accomplishments this was my reward and i'm super super happy that i was able to get it um so let's go let's just try to take this over to the box <laughs> Are we ready? Woo! That is a beautiful, beautiful computer, you guys. Look at that. Lovely 27 inch 2019 iMac desktop. I am in love. I am very satisfied. I am excited. This computer is going to make me a lot of money trading. <laughs> Spend it all on it, so it has to make me back it, right? So guys, that's pretty much it. I am super stoked. Um, 
I'm gonna clean up. So the floor is a mess right now. And I'm gonna get everything set up. And Rico is gonna, he's struggling. <laughs> when my chair, apparently it was more difficult than his chair to create. But he's gonna get through that. I'm gonna clean up down here, set up everything, and I'll see you guys in a few with the final product.